Hello darlings, this is Maya broadcasting out the UK and this is going to be a super short video. I am sorry guys and gals, this finished projects and whips I have not done a lot. The coronation weekend has just been crazy. Not only that, before then I had a lot, quite a lot of other things that I needed to do um, that took up a lot of time and especially energy. Um, I've also been doing and uh, carrying on with some gardening so let's just get down to it and I have one finished object and that is this scarf. There we go, here it is finished and I hope you like it. I was thinking of making it an infinity but I had sewed it up, well, I hadn't crocheted it together at the bottom here, but when I looked at it in the end, I didn't like it, so I undid it again, and I've just stuck with a general scarf, because I feel it has a lot more uses, you can wear it like this, like that, just tie it up, or the other way around, of course should you need it under a coat so I felt this was the better way to do it um, and this took up exactly one skein of yarn one skein of yarn for a short for a scarf there we go so this is my finished project and I'll give you another close-up there you go and it's lovely, the texture is lovely, I must say, for such a simple stitch. I love how it falls, I love the texture of it. I haven't blocked it yet. I might not, sometimes I'm lazy with these things. If they're my own, I don't block them necessarily. So the next one is also a scarf that I have started. And that is this one, and I've noticed I've gone a bit wibbly wobbly on it but it doesn't matter so this is called it's called the stitch is called the starburst stitch and the pattern for it actually calls for a different number of stitches but I'm using a one weight yarn which is fingering so and it's from ice it is called the oh dear now I've forgotten Nova something I'll put it down in the bottom anyway so I started this with 44 stitch stitches 44 chains and it's more of a stardust I could have most I'm using a what five mil hook five millimeter hook I think the next time round I would most probably use a six millimeter hook even bigger just so that it's a little bit more airy but the texture is lovely and it does look very pretty um, yeah I made a little mistake here on the side some I didn't count properly and went into the wrong one that's probably why I was doing it but having some doing it in the dark or watching television or paying attention but anyway if you block it that that won't matter but it feels lovely what I have noticed with this especially with this stitch I would use a yarn that doesn't have a lot of give so this doesn't have a lot of give and it's rather um, it glides um, it's a slippery yarn so something like a silk if you want a silk or something like this um, is absolutely perfect for it however as I said I would most probably take next time a bigger hook size but it is lovely and it makes a lovely lovely pattern I'm glad that I did this like that because I was thinking of using it maybe for a blouse this pattern or a top so it's perfect for that because you can't see through it um, yeah so 
that is all I have to show. Not done much more than that. I am sorry, <laughs> just not got round to it. And I have a, I don't know, I think I've got like a carpal tunnel, but tennis elbow. I don't know, it's weird anyway. So that's going to have to rest for a few days, so I won't be doing anything for a few days. So maybe I'll see you next week with um, more projects. I have loads of projects lined up and loads of yarn to get through. Um, I have for this, actually, I just wanted to mention I have six balls of yarn for this. Each are a hundred, no, it's 50 grams and this has barely touched it, as you can see. Barely touched it so far, even though I thought this would be a yarn eater. Not as much as I thought, which surprised me. So there you go, I'll tell you at the end. I'll give you another close-up. I'll tell you at the end, once I get to it, or halfway through, or however, how much it's been taken. There you go. So I'll catch up with you soon. Loving you, leaving you, and I'm missing you already. See you soon. Bye.